from the Outer Banks Voice, I'm Sam Walker. Can we give you a perspective on how things are going weather-wise? We've got this onshore flow that's been on top of us for <laughs> basically the last week, it seems like, but really over the last few days, onshore breeze. We've seen rain showers move on shore this afternoon. And I want to give you a little comparison to what forecasters are expecting for us on Saturday as Matthew gets closer and then of course pulls out to sea well to our south. This is today's conditions about what we're going to see on Saturday for most of the day, but we're going to see a little bit more wind and we may see some gusts to tropical storm level out of Matthew once we get to Saturday. But here Thursday, getting some rain, getting that onshore breeze. We've got some pretty high surf that we're gonna pull over here at Avalon Pier and just give you an idea of the level of surf we've got. And that's pretty much the conditions we're going to see as Matthew gets closer, but again, stays to our south and gives us just the outer bands of weather coming up on Saturday for here on the Outer Banks. In fact, not the only ones that are taking a look at the conditions today here at Avalon Pier in Kill Level Hills. In fact, if you guys are trying to ride this stuff, Try to give you a better focus here with the raindrops that's not helping but uh, there's the scene here Let's stick her out so there's an idea of what we've got going on here in the Outer Banks today Again, not related to Matthew directly, just uh, kind of uh, the product this onshore wind we've had really for the last few days, producing uh, some rain showers this afternoon into the evening. And again, on Saturday is when our weather is expected to be worse, and we'll see showers, heavy rainfall at times, upwards two to four inches the prediction right now, and wind gusts of up to tropical storm force when Matthew makes his closest approach on Saturday. From the Outer Banks Voice, I'm Sam Walker.